Hey, I'm Phil, and this is also Phil, but as an AI character, animated just from a photo, which you can generate for free. This is so cool. AI real person video can be so useful for small businesses and creators for so many reasons, social media. Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Learning and development, explainer videos, even a digital business card. Hello, this is Movio Avatar, and here is my business card. So cool. If you've been around my channel before, you know that I often share exciting tools, including some for AI. But I have to say, this is the best one that I have found in terms of realism. Those characters, real characters or CG characters are called like you saw with David or the business card a second ago. The ones that I just showed you look very realistic, more so than other AI tools. And best of all, they are easy to make and it doesn't cost a fortune and it's let's be honest it's kind of fun it's called movio let's jump right in i'm phil palin a brand strategist welcome to my channel where i promise practical advice to build your brand i'm so glad you're here because i love talking about ai specifically how creators and small businesses benefiting from incorporating it into their world, there are so many benefits. When I discovered Movio, today's sponsor, I immediately was impressed by how real these characters look. This is a super powerful tool. You also get a choice between real life characters and CG characters. So here's a real character, for example. And now a CG character for a totally different style. Simply replace the talking photo, then you can drive your selfie speaking on this video business card. So now that you've seen a whole bunch of examples, let's dive into the platform itself. So here I am logged in and there's so many exciting things to show you. I think I'll start here from the template gallery. This is the first option. And I have shown you already some of these examples. I think there's some really good examples here that could inspire your project. I love that you can filter here for different types of use cases. So breaking news, I haven't mentioned that one yet. Advertising, we talked about social media, learning, business card, etc. You can easily click these and it will give you some of the pre-existing templates that you can use to start your project. Now, I should also note, we've been focusing on landscape examples, obviously, because this is a YouTube video, it is landscape. You also have the ability to create portrait examples. So portrait um, templates, which look something like this, right? So this is perfect if you're wanting to post on uh, stories, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Stories, TikTok. Um, this allows you to create content very quickly without you, for example, having to be in the video. You can use an existing avatar. Speaking of avatar, let's go to the avatar gallery right now. So right away, you'll see that they are grouped into two uh, different groupings. So real human avatar as well as CG avatar. We've talked about this a second ago, but I want you to see just how many options you have to choose from here. So if we start with a real human avatar, we can choose one with different outfits. So right away, you can see it here in action. If I click play, it will play that example and it will help me decide if that one is appropriate for my project. I can also click show all and it's gonna show me the entire gallery of real human avatars. I've tried a lot of tools and this by far has I think the most um, avatars that I've ever seen to be able to choose, to be able to start from. Also remember that once you create your video, you can adjust the crop, right? You can make your character big, you can make it small, and there's gonna be other settings that we'll see once we actually jump in and create our own. This is also very unique. The idea that there are CG avatars. So these are not pretending to look like real humans. They kind of embrace this idea of like digital technology, characters, almost like you know, you've, you'd find in an animated film. I really love this because it's again, not pretending to be real, like simulated reality. It's actually embracing this kind of digital quality. Again, I can click play and you can see that character in action and you can choose the right one for your project. Now let's jump in and actually create something together. I'll go ahead and create a video. So I'll click up here, create video. Let's for this example, create landscape. 
And here's how it's going to look when you are actually in the editor to create your own. So I mentioned that I love the CG humans, so I'm going to choose one for our video. Let's choose this guy. So right away, he'll pop him in the frame and I can adjust it however I want. Again, decrease the size, um, you know, even down here. So this is Lucas. You can see all of the settings and this is going to give you all kinds of variables that you can set from language, gender, age, style. Uh, let's go ahead and make him cheerful. Um, that sounds good to me. You can also preview the audio there, but we'll do that in a second. Let's move right along to text. So let's say I wanted to add some text here. Um, for this example, I'm just gonna put, uh, let's say example title. We're not actually making a video here. I just wanna show you how easy it is. I also love that there are preset styles. So for example, I actually really love how that looks. So if I delete that title, I can click here we go. I'll choose all of those and I will just click drag. And let's say this guy is going to tell us about a big sale coming up. So I would adjust the text down here. We have a big sale coming up this weekend. Get up to 50% off. See you there. You know, just some example text. Here, if I want to turn subtitles on, I can. I'm going to leave them off for this example, but I want you to know that they are there. Speed and pitch, you would adjust those here. Now let's go ahead and click play script. This is going to let us hear it before it actually gets animated. We have a big sale coming up this weekend. Get up to 50% off. See you there. There you go, so we heard it. I like the speed and I like the pitch, so we're gonna leave those settings and let's keep going so I can show you what else is within this editor. And under elements, this is gonna be everything you might need to enhance your canvas. So from frames, if I wanna grab something here and put something within the iPhone, I certainly can. I would just drag an image into that spot, not for this example. Stickers, so you see social uh, icons here popular social media platforms. You might want to be talking about those so you can quickly drag those stickers in. We've got icons, we've got images, we've got video. I think we should go ahead and pop uh, in a image that might match. So we're talking about a sale. I think we can go ahead and choose this image. Now I'm gonna to want to move it to the back. So I would click layers and I would say, send this to the back. And I'll just drag this so that it fills the screen. And I wanna show you just a few more um, bits in here under elements we haven't talked about. Uh, shapes can be really useful. Let's say I wanted to highlight this text. I could adjust this shape, put that in behind by adjusting again my layers so I can send it backward. There we go. I'm not gonna keep that for this example. Again, just demonstrating quickly what you can do in here as well as music. So it's perfect. These are all easy uh, to just drop in. You don't have to worry about going and sourcing these somewhere else. Everything is here. It makes it really, really easy. Now, if you want to upload a uh, video or music or images of your own, you can, of course, right? That would make this super customizable depending on what it is you're wanting to create. Uh, for this example though, just to save time, I'm gonna show you using these existing elements that I have uh, found directly in Movio. Before I click submit, we're gonna just preview our project. And I want you to remember that character animation is not available in preview. It's gonna take a few seconds, sometimes a few minutes to actually generate that. So you're not gonna see it animated, but you're still gonna get an idea of what the final project is gonna look like. Let's click play. We have a big sale coming up this weekend. Get up to 50% off. See you there. I like how this is looking. Again, this is a quick example. So when I am satisfied, I can go ahead and click submit. And here on this screen under my video, you will see that that video is now processing, which will take just a few minutes. Okay, so I fast forwarded that to jump to the completed video and now you can see it is completed because that image is rendering in the background. I am so excited to click play. Let's have a look. We have a big sale coming up this weekend. Get up to 50% off. See you there.
awesome. Considering I made that so quickly, literally in a matter of minutes to just be able to show you, I am so seriously impressed. There's the text at the bottom that I had typed. If I wanna be able to share this directly, uh, I can. You would just click share and it gives you that little call to action spot where you can enter something here, um, as well as a button. And then there is a web widget, which is super cool. I can go ahead and click and adjust the shape and it will give me some code that I could paste on my website if I wanted to display like that. Now, it is free to try this out with the watermark. Do you see the watermark? Uh, uh, burnt into the image or the video in this case. So note that it is free to generate video, but that watermark will be there. The last thing to point out, and I've jumped over here to the pricing page, is as I mentioned, it is free to create uh, videos, but the watermark will be there. If you don't want that watermark, then you can jump on the essential plan, which gives you 10 minutes without watermark, and that is $30 a month. And you also have the option of buying extra minutes, uh, just depending on how much you need for your particular particular project. This is a one-time payment. The extra minutes don't expire. And if you need more than that, including API request, priority support, access to premium services, they have an enterprise plan as well. Now there's one more feature that I want to show you in Movio that I think is really cool. At the time of recording this video, it's still in beta, so it's a little bit experimental, but it is seriously awesome. You saw how I could choose from pre-made avatars. Well, you can also create your own. Take a look at this. Now, this I have never seen before on another tool. This is so exciting. So we had looked before at public avatars. Remember these? I want to show you one more thing, which is the My Avatar. You can play around with a talking photo. Again, this is in beta, but I want to show you how you can actually upload your own photo. I've uploaded mine. I'll show you in a second. Here are the recommendations on uploading that photo. So a perfect photo is you you looking, or someone else, looking straight forward. Uh, no mouth open, no side face, no overexposure, no mask, that makes sense, and no border blur. So I have found a photo of myself. They also have some demos here that you can try out, but this is so super cool. Let's, uh, what we're gonna do is add some text as we do. I am going to experiment with Movio using my own photo. Let's make it talk. And before I go ahead and click submit, we have to choose the right voice. I preview these beforehand and I sound the most like Todd. So I'm going to go ahead and select that option. And now I'm going to hit submit. While we wait for this to render, I'm gonna hop over back to the avatars under my avatar and let you know that you can also request your own avatar. So by clicking that button, it's gonna give you some extensive instructions on exactly how you can film yourself with some best practices, including background, camera, audio, and then the footage delivery. Uh, this has all of the info you would need to be able to create your own avatar. And guess what? My avatar is ready for us to watch. Let's take a look. I am going to experiment with Movio using my own photo. Let's make it talk. That is amazing. Seriously, I am dumbfounded that this is a feature that is built into this tool that you can go and try right now. So that is Movio. Can you tell I had some fun playing around with this awesome tool? Recently, it got the product of the day number one badge on Product Hunt, and I can totally see why. By the way, the cost for requesting your own custom avatar is $600 at the time of recording this video, which is less expensive than other platforms for custom avatars. Pretty awesome. Animating from your own photo, though. I showed you that as well. That's built into this platform, so maybe that's somewhere that you can start if you want want something or you want a specific avatar of someone that would be custom, just think about what makes the most sense for your business. I honestly think this is the perfect tool for business owners, sales or marketing professionals, HR for training purposes, learning and development, the list goes on. It is remarkable how you can animate an avatar from just a photo. It is so cool, so accessible. I am a big fan of Movio. Try it for free. I'm linking to it in the description below. Again, you saw how easy it is to create your own character. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. That helps other people discover these videos, which we work hard to create for you and subscribe for more of my videos on branding, positioning, building, and promoting your brand. Next, I'm sharing a few videos I think you'll be interested in. I'm Phil Palin. Thanks for watching. And those videos are coming up next.